Greetings and salutations. Hope this finds you well. Sitting in the parking lot here. Wait for the people to get down in front of me so I could fill up some spring water. Anyways. Hurricane, was it Helen or Helene that wreaked a whole lot of devastation and destruction on communities on the East Coast? And FEMA said, well, we're actually, we're about $8.7, $9 billion short. And Joe Biden said, well, we, there's nothing else. There's nothing else we can do. Literally the day before U.S. Congress and the Biden administration, Biden-Harris, approved $9 billion in weapons to Israel so they can go bomb hospitals and burn human beings including children alive right that's the priorities of the US ruling class and their puppets in Congress and in the White House they give they care so little they couldn't care less about the working class people in the US ones who have literally just been impacted by natural disaster, you know, that's also caused by climate change. So that's just another slap in the face, right? Because the US military, biggest polluter in the world, and then we're gonna give $9 billion more in weapons to further Israel's genocide against the Palestinians, and then their continued assault and terrorist activities or attempted genocide against the people in Lebanon. I mean, like Joe Biden says, it, there, there's nothing else they could do. They give all that money and weapons to to Israel to go burn more babies and children alive. All right, I got to pull over, get some water. Peace, much love, all solidarity to the people in Palestine and Lebanon and the access of resistance.